ceremony. Uh, I'm Scott Larson, Executive Director for the Marshall Area Chamber of Commerce and Industry. It's my uh, real pleasure and honor to be the MC for the event this afternoon. What a great opportunity. Beautiful facility. Um, really a family-owned company, second generation, working on third generation. It's a company that's been here for over 50 years. Really what a pleasure for us to be out here and help them celebrate this beautiful new facility that they have. So with that, we're going to get started. We've got a, a number of speakers. And first up, uh, representing the town of Marshfield is Alan Bry. Alan? Marshfield area chamber of commerce and industry. We celebrate uh, commerce and industry throughout the, the area around Marshfield. I'm so excited on behalf of the city, the council, the staff, the mayor, and everybody to just congratulate Shallows on, on 50 plus years of successful business out here and growth and development now, this great addition. Um, we're just very proud of what they do, and we know a lot of people will look forward to uh, coming here in years to come. So we want to wish you guys all the best. We want to congratulate you on this accomplishment. And uh, if you ever need any help from us, let us know. Thank you. Great. Thank you, Steve. We're glad that the city could be a part of this celebration as well. Uh, up next, representing the Nikki Board of Directors, is our president, Pat Wessenberg. Pat? this facility and what's going on here and a little bit about the business. So uh, let's all welcome Gordy Shallow. Gordy? Good afternoon. Welcome. I see storm coming, so I'll try to make this a short version. <laughs> <laughs> but this planning, this planning started back in 2000 when I came to Hill make a call and we put together a plan which would have been located in the east of us. I called the two industry consultants to review what our plans were. They just put everything on hold and said we could obtain these two parcels on the corner. The last time it was fine, early on I didn't have a resource. We could obtain these two parcels. And then the Highway 10 project started. And we waited for all the ups and downs of what Highway 10 was going to bring. And we were fortunate that Highway 10 stayed to the south of us. Well, see, that enabled us to pick up the two parcels to the south, or to the north here, which we're standing on right now. Um, from that point on, I got my daughter involved, Katie, who's an architect from the Twin Cities.
Mr. Tim Rankin. We are the first one. We're welcoming additional business out here, which will do us a good in return in the future. I also want to make recognition to our sponsors and the people who made this day possible uh, to help us through the construction process. Uh, Associated Bank, Data Flow, Design Unlimited, Join Excavating, also Heating, Johnson Brothers Construction, which I want to let you know that's my extended family from Unison, Michigan. They drove six hours to take this job on, and I can't say enough about them. Not only did they get it done on time, they got it under budget. And a lot of construction, you can't say that today. Uh, I thank Greg, Marv, Alex, Greg, and uh, Cliff. And I'm sorry that Craig couldn't be with us today, but I can't say enough about them. They were just fantastic to work with. Um, I also want to make a special thank you to my parents. They're both with us yet today. Dave and Carol. Everyone really wants to have the courage to get this thing started 51 years ago, and they're still committed to helping us out today. If you didn't know, my father had a pacemaker put in in uh, February, and I'm making him slow down and not work as hard as he used to. And I know it's starting to rain, so I'll let you come in. Okay. I left off with my parents. I left off with my parents again. Thank you very much, Mom and Dad. Uh, I also wanted to make note to my wife, Kathy. Uh, I've been fortunate to spend 35 years with her, plus a few uh, before that. Uh, she's a full-time teacher in the Marshfield School District, looking to retire in the near future. And from that, she has put her heart and soul in this thing as well, being a buyer. So I can't say enough, and I appreciate everything she's done. She's begged me for the same length of time that we thought about doing this to get a cottage, but this is my version of a cottage. <laughs> <laughs> and again, uh, Associated Bank for your financial support, Harlan Rose and Brian Rutschow from Dataflow for your guidance and planning and assuring me that this is gonna be a positive venture. Uh, our employees, uh, the ones that have been with, with us for 20 plus years, I can't say enough, Mike Kupfer, Rick Tischendorf, Mark Stofflett, Sherry Swissio, Ryan Verdon, and my brother Mark, who's a partner in the business as well. And then the new faces that keeps us on our toes, uh, Andrea, Kathy, Lori, Nick, and Jerry Ann, believe it or not, Jerry Ann used to live on this property. Is she, is she in here now? There she is. If you don't know her, Jerry Ann's here, she's, uh, been with us now for the first year and a, a vital part of our operation as well. And uh, it, she, I think, kidding me the other day when she said, uh, I always said to her that someday we were gonna build on this parcel, but that was the plan, but I never really wanted to lead her on to that either. So, uh, again, thank you to our employees. Most importantly, really our customers that have been with us and supported us for these 51 years. This wouldn't be possible without all of our customer base. So thank you very much. And uh, please enjoy the evening on Business After Five. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. right, before we get to that point, though, we've got a little matter of an actual ribbon cutting to do. So I'm going to give you the, the rib, the okay. scissors. And I know you wanted your daughter and, and some yeah. of the staff to come up. Yep, all the employees, they could stand behind yep. us. Do they all want to come up? Stand in, stand in the background here. <laughs>
but it worked out great thing. You've got the new garden center that we could move into. Um, Gordy, I think you did a fantastic job. I think success is the word to use for making a, a, a first point of contact for people coming into Marshall. This is a beautiful facility coming down the highway to see. We wish you all the best with it. We hope that you're here for at least another 50 years. And uh, that'll conclude the ribbon cutting portion of the uh, nursery, the shallow nursery and garden center. Uh, as you already mentioned, we want to encourage everybody to stay See all the great products that they have inside the nursery here. And then we do have our business after five. We want to encourage everybody to come out and join us for that as well. So on behalf of Mackie, uh, thank you for attending the Shallow Nursery and Garden Center Ribbon Cutting Ceremony. Thank you.